it's Monday. Welcome to Five Girls Five Minutes. I'm still Sarah. It is exciting to be Sarah. Not really. Um, <laughs> so I'm gonna get right to the questions because that's what we do. Tara was talking about summer plans and asked us what our summer plans are. Um, I have some exciting summer plans. Um, my sister's getting married in July. Um, so we're having like family party time. We're actually going, not my sister, but my parents and I are going to uh, Ohio for a family reunion and then we're bringing back certain family members for the wedding, which is like right after. Um, so yeah, that'll be July and uh, the rest of the summer I'm pretty much just enjoying summer, hopefully getting a job so that I have money. But yeah, I don't have any other real plans. There's a few concerts maybe here and there, but smatterings. <laughs> um, I kind of like not having too much planned because, I mean, which is funny coming from me because I'm like compulsively, I have to know what I'm doing every, like whenever I'm doing something, I have to have it planned out when and what times and yeah. But like, I don't like having too many plans because it, it leaves it a little bit more like relaxy and I can do things that I just decide that I want to do. If the whole summer was planned out, like constant trips and stuff, I think I would need a vacation from my vacation, essentially. So, yeah. But it's exciting. There's gonna be family. I haven't seen family, some of the family in a while, so, um, yeah. My sister's getting married, which is cool. Uh, I just actually picked, up, picked out a dress yesterday for that, so. I've been to two weddings. One of them was my sister's before. We're not going to get into that. Anyway, um, yeah. So, and then <laughs> Tally asked a question about questions. She asked, is there a question? I'm always asked. We're always asked. Um, I'm always asked how I'm so awesome. Not really. Um, I'm always asked, this is stupid. Are you sitting down? This is very stupid. I've been asked a lot of times why my name doesn't have an H. And I don't ever really know. I think sometimes I've, I said it was stolen. Um, yeah. <laughs> but that's, that's an actual question. People have asked me why um, that. Some people have asked me why I'm short before too. It was mostly my friend. And it was mostly because she was teasing, but other people have asked me too, like, you're short, why are you short? I get asked really dumb questions. Um, trying to think of what else. Um, I've been asked what squinchilla is, and that's a squirrel chinchilla hybrid. Uh, posthumously is like posthumously, which I can't even really pronounce, you know, like when something is published after you die or whatever. But for me, it's after the laughter, not after death, because it's humorously. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I get asked kind of dumb things. I don't get asked things like, what are you going to do? Um, very often. I think people have just given up on me. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to ask you and tell you a little bit about... I went to this science and engineering e expo um, in DC, which was really fun. I went with Luis and uh, the Mythbusters were there. Bill Nye the science guy was there. Um, Mayim Bialik was there from the Big Bang Theory, and she kept talking about Bill Prady, and I was like, oh my god, Tally, Tally knows all about this, she should be here. Um, I didn't get to meet any of the people, the, the crowds, th that's what I want to focus on. There were so many people there, and lots of times crowds make me antsy, nervous. Um, it wasn't so bad though, sometimes crowds can be stressful, sometimes crowds can be kind of fun, like uh, camaraderie crowds. Um, and it felt a little bit like both, but sometimes when we were standing around, especially for the Mythbusters, we were standing around and it sort of felt like a camaraderie crowd because people were like talking to each other and laughing because they couldn't really see the Mythbusters too well. But like, yeah, I don't know, it's hard to describe, but how are you in crowds? Can you handle crowds? Do they make you nervous? Are they thrilling? Um, uh, a lot of times it depends on who you're with and what the crowd is for, I guess. Like, crowds at the DMV. Never very fun. Unless you're a crazy person. Are you a crazy person? That could be my second question. Um, 
But yeah, that that was my that was my weekend. And then I finally saw The Hunger Games, and I really liked it. I liked The Hunger Games more than The Hunger Games book. I'm reading the second one now, right there. Um, I'm almost done with it actually. I think I'm on the last chapter. I like the second one more than the first one, book-wise, but I liked the movie a lot. So, yes, for those of you who like The Hunger Games, I, f I finally caught on to it. I hope you all have an awesome week. Tara, I will see you tomorrow. That was awkward. Bye. <laughs>